So you've been fighting for mental health awareness and to make sure that we are getting the resources and the knowledge out to people who need it. Why do you think that's so important? It's important because we are in a time now where people's feelings are valid. And for so long, we have been um, suppress suppressing our feelings, um, you know, keeping them held in, don't want to let people know because the stigma, if you express your feelings, um, the stigma that has been put on there that you're weak, something wrong with you. So it's important for me to make sure people know that your feelings are truly valid. Awesome. So now you've been doing events and different things to help people get that message out. What do you have coming up soon? I'll be doing the Chief Association down on the Mississippi Gulf Coast. Um, it'll be in the month of June. Um, I'll have all chiefs throughout the state of Mississippi um, for two hours. We're going to be talking about mental health. Um, so that is uh, one of the biggest um, events that I've had um, locally. I have been at many churches. Um, I'll be doing a church this weekend in the Kapai County area, um, Hazelhurst. Um, I've been in that area. I've been up in the Holmes County also doing uh, mental health awareness and I'll be back. Do you feel like we've made some strides in mental health awareness? We have a ways to go, but we have made some strides because people are getting a little bit more comfortable about talking about their mental health, um, what they're feeling, how they are feeling. Um, you know, they know that there is help available. We're trying to make sure, um, especially with our youth and our teenagers, because the suicide rate has gone up, um, that they know help is available. You know, you're not alone. Uh, we got to make it to the point and I, uh, where people are comfortable. I am so elated with some of the churches um, are opening their doors to start, you know, having a physical meeting and talking about mental health. Um, we all sitting in one place and, you know, you at a mental health workshop at the church. You know, we didn't have that um, often time that the minister would be more than welcome and say, come on in, we're going to talk about suicide, mental health, what are the things we could do? So I, I'm glad. I think we have made a stride when it comes to the religious sector of it.